Welcome to Stride University. We're um, continuing our exploration of the operations tab in the inventory management system here. And uh, this time we're going to go right into inventory adjustments. This should be a quick, uh, just a quick show of what's going on here. Uh, the inventory adjustment screen is where you can do uh, bulk updates of uh, all of your products. Now, the only products that show up in, in this report are products that have available quantity um, or count it like this one needs to be set. So it needs to either be positive or negative. Uh, zero quantities typically will, know, will not show up on this report unless you've added. So someone has added this one here and it just needs to be applied. Otherwise, uh, zero quantities um, or on-hand quantities of, of zero or more will, will show up. Uh, available is not typically the on-hand quantity is what will show. So if it's negative or positive, it shows up in this report. Uh, if you need to add a product, you can click on new and, and give it a count, uh, find that product and it will add it to the system. But this is where you're gonna do your inventory adjustments, any inventory counts. Uh, you can do those in bulk here. There are also, you can do inventory adjustments on the individual products, but um, just by going to the card and, and creating those. Uh, this is barcode scannable, so if you have a laptop that you carry around while you do your inventory, you can attach that to your barcode reader, scan it, and it'll pop, pull up that that barcode or SKU, and you can just type in your your actual counted quantity and say, yep, uh, this was 124. We know that. We're good to go. I'm going to apply. Boom. And, uh, and away we go. So. That's made the inventory adjustments. It, it adjusts those based on the, the cost that you brought them in and, and makes those entries. So inventory adjustments.